Hello everyone. Welcome back to Crypto by YouTube channel. So inside this video, I have amazing news about Pi Network, especially about the KYC. Those users is still having problem with the KYC. Is still their KYC is not approved or they just want to resubmit their KYC application. I have a good news for everyone. Finally, we receive a new updates about the KYC. It means Open Manet is confirmed in 2024. We will see Open Manet of Pi Network. We will see Open Manet of Ice Network. So I can say 2024 is one of the best year for everyone. So somehow I have good news. Somehow I have a bad news about the Pi Network. So stay tuned. Don't skip any part of the video. Whatever I am saying, listen carefully. Because this is one of the best update about the KYC. Why your KYC is stuck. Why is still your KYC is not approved. Each and everything I will cover inside this video. Don't skip any part of the video. Share this video with everyone, with your team members, with your referrals, so that their KYC should be approved. Okay, now let's get started. If you are new to this channel and you want to get more videos about Witty Network, Ice Network, Pi Network, Mining Application, even about Pre-Sale Project, so make sure click on the subscribe button, hit the bell icon to get notification while upload a new video. So you know Open Manet is going to launch in this year. So if you if you check the progress, so 60% already completed. Only 40% remaining until we see the open manet. You know, this is all because the KYC is not completed. Token migration is not completed. You know, on the roadmap, we check that we need to complete three conditions in order to see the open manet. But also developers are working very hard to solve. Uh, those problems like about KYC, about token migrations. Also, we need to cooperate with developers. We need to help developers in order to accomplish those three conditions so that we should see the open mainnet. Okay, now, this is the Pi KYC update. So, since KYC is an important metric in the open mainnet plan, so we are providing exciting updates in the KYC process that unblocked hundreds of thousands of applications to continue. So, Piners, go to the home screen to learn more. This is the article, the latest update about the KYC uh, process. So, we will check at the end of this video. Inside this article, we can find everything about the KYC. Why is still your KYC is stuck? Why is still your KYC is not approved? What problem you just did? What mistake you just did? The whole thing we will check this article. Also, you can see. Over a million applications have been unblocked thanks to improved algorithm and resubmission opportunities. You know, lots of applications blocked like uh, they're about their KYC, about uh, they did not apply for the KYC, they did not get KYC info, uh, invitation or notification. So of course, millions of applications have been unblocked. Now everyone can apply for the KYC, everyone can complete their KYC. This is good news. The number of Piners receiving KYC have increased. So have you received KYC? Of course, in Q1 2024, I can say till March 2024, developers are trying to fix all the problem, especially KYC problem, especially token migration problem. So have you received a KYC invitation? Because lots of users are getting KYC, lots of users are their KYCs, just approving. This is all because developers are just working very hard to fix those problems. So the bad news is in here. Bondix CEO calling Pi Network worthless mining project while charging people three dollar for KYC because the platform is not able to validate three million users. So Pi Network is at eight million KYC verified users, all paid the verification with Pi forty applications and a reasonable offline and online ecosystem. Okay guys, so you can see in here. You can see this picture. Yes, go to a worthless mining project with no use case like Pi Network. Even KYC has no more boards. So we already have capture no boards on our platform. Even if I show you the next screenshot, you can see. Charging $3 is a scam, I think. So we have 3 million users. That would cost us $9 million. Until after the TGE, we will not have the funding to do that. So we cannot airdrop without getting the travel with SAC unless everyone has done KYC. So before you use a word like a scam, think OS can be informed 
also a three dollar for a minimum of two thousand return is a solid investment so bonding ceo saying that pi network is worthless mining project okay now those who completed their kyc let me know in comment section did you pay three dollar for your kyc let me know in the comment section have you or no because in here you can see saying that it just cost three dollar to complete your kyc so now let me know in the comment section have you paid three dollar for your kyc okay further you can see another e scam in here no one can speed up your kyc migration or lockup period no one on social media check in here should i trust people offering quick migrations and early lockup on instagram inside the social media there are lots of scammers they are asking you for payment they will just take your money they cannot do anything they cannot complete your kyc they cannot migrate your token they cannot speed up the process of kyc on migration so do not do these things do not pay anything for your kyc because only developers can help you no one else so this is time to check this article kyc process update for pioneers you know on the second roadmap roadmap version 2 on december 27 we just read that if we want to see the open minute we need to complete three conditions so the condition second is one of the most one of the important condition which is all about kyc migration utility so because of that developers just take serious about the kyc they are just trying to solve this problem although if you check this article inside this article you can find why your kyc is stuck what mistake you have done what is the problem each and everything you can get inside this article i know lots of kyc is stuck so developers are trying to solve those problem okay the first one is identifying and addressing a core problem this problem is missing or have incorrectly entered information you know at the first time while we see the kyc some some of the users did not take it serious they just put wrong information they just used wrong information so because of that their kyc is stuck because of that their kyc is not approved because at the first time you did not take it serious even like uploading your id documents the quality is not good the background is not good your name is not same even you did not use your original name so with unclear id image so because of that your kyc is stuck one thing i should tell you developers cannot do like uh, i can say individual person cannot help us you know there are millions of applications so how developers only developers should fix those problem so we should cooperate with developers we should help them like uh, how we can help them provide your original name high quality id documents like with high quality image with clear background with clear lightning everything so if you use wrong information if you use a third quality image so of course your kyc will not be approved this is the first problem so the second you can you can check in here solutions and recent effectiveness so developers are just trying to fix those problem like how the first one is comprehensive application reprocessing so over 1.5 million applications in, in total that were stuck in the kyc process due to missing data in your application okay from 1.5 million only 200,000 unblocked so 1.3 million is still remaining is still remaining cases is still 1.3 million cases have issue so they are trying to solve it by the end of november 2023 1.3 million applications is still they are facing problem is still developers are trying to fix it so after that after the month of november 2023 you can see 1.3 million so from 1.3 million 500 32,000 applications get unstuck and move in their KYC journey. Of course, still there are some applications that are stuck about the KYC. So resubmission opportunities for pioneers. Of course, one more chance you will get to resubmit your KYC. Make sure this time use the uh, high quality ID documents, your original name, just to use the name that mentioned inside your ID card. You can see we allowed about 768,000 remaining applications blocked 
by this issue to have one more chance to resubmit their applications. So 768,000 applications, they will get a new opportunity to resubmit their application to resubmit the KYC. Okay, validators review as the solution. Of course, validators will check the application. They will check your documents, the quality, and then they will just uh, process it for the next step. Okay, now, although you can check this article, you can read this article from A to Z, but I will read the important parts of this article. Okay, improved liveness video processing. Okay, there were about 153,000 KYC applications before November 2023 that were struck in the KYC process due to failures of processing their video in their initial submission. Unblocking applications with watermark issue, like uh, some of your applications with a watermark, of course, they will block you. Of course, they will block your applications. So further, 1,367 finders to continue their KYC process. Their application just unblock. Checking this article, we just get that developers just unblock thousands of applications. They just solve thousands of issues. They just give hundreds of users a new chance to resubmit their KYC application. So in here you can see some of the tips for pioneers for a smoother KYC process. If you want to just uh, complete your KYC very fast, quickly, so make sure to check these things. Complete information. Use the complete information, original information. High quality document image with clear uh, background, clear color with high quality and the correct country of ID submission. Use the country that mentioned inside your ID card. For example, you are living in uh, Australia, but your ID card is from India, but you are using Australia. Why use India? Because inside your ID documents, the country is India. So make sure you use the correct country, consistent ID document submission, and the consistent language in data entry. This is the tips if you want to complete your KYC because more than 700,000 users will get a new chance to resubmit their KYC application. Once again, if you do any mistake, so forget about Pi Network, forget about your Pi Quiz because till when developers should solve your problem. You do mistake, developer should solve it. Once again, you do mistake, developer should solve it. We need to cooperate with Pi developers because only developers cannot solve this problem. There are lots of applications, so single person cannot do it. We have to cooperate with them. We have to submit original information, high quality documents, correct country, each and everything. You can check this article. Inside this article, you can find each and everything about the KYC. So make sure to check it. You can find it inside the official website. Go to blog and then you can find this article. Okay, so now let me know in the comment section. While doing your KYC, did you pay $3 for your KYC? First thing. Second one, did you receive the re uh, resubmit or uh, resubmit option about your KYC? Even did your KYC is approved or no? Let me know in the comment section. So this is all about Pi Network. I hope you understand this video. I hope you like this video. So share this video with your team members, with your referrals. Like this video. I only like, I only want a like from your side. Because this channel is only because of you. I am because of you. Thank you so much for your support, for the watching. Thank you so much. I really appreciate. So don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to share your thoughts in the comment section. If I'm not replying your comment, but I'm reading, I'm reading your problem, I'm reading your comment. So in the upcoming video, I will talk about it. So that's why make sure to watch the video, make sure to listen carefully. Okay, so smash the like button to a new all time high. If still did not subscribe to our channel, make sure to click on the subscribe button. Hit the bell icon to get notification while upload a new video. So till the next video, goodbye. See you.